Hi, Jeff Duffield. Hi, you look nice you in your again. Walmart shirt. My $16 Walmart <laughs> special. You know, Walmart had some great clothes this year. I don't know why. Maybe it's because we're on that minimalistic living more than ever before. Or we're cheap. <laughs> We're not cheap. We're just trying to use God's finances as wisely as we can. How are I don't you? know if Walmart's the best place to do that, but <laughs> this is where you found the shirt. True. It's a very comfortable it is shirt. A nice shirt. It will be very warm by the time we're done this I evening. But Thank okay. you for tuning in. We love you so much. And honestly, we're going to try and fulfill some requests that we've been getting in through the week and then even from the last Couch to Kitchen concert last this week. This ought to be good. So... Jeff's going to play a song for Steve Miller. Steve, you better be listening. This is just yeah, for gonna, you. As a matter of fact, we probably should send him a text, but too late. Uh, uh, wait, where's your phone? Too late. Okay. Well, anyway, it is Misty, and it's all Jeff Duffield right, right here. It's right here. Go ahead and play. Mis- We're going to lose him if you don't play real oh, fast. Oh, okay, okay. Well, let, me, let me turn on. Um, so <laughs> don't, don't say anything because I'm going to turn the reverb oh. on. And it sounds funny. Don't look at and I have room tonight. I I'm, I'm excited. I moved over. I know. We could do the Nashville version of this. Very nice. Oh, Very my. Nice. I still like <laughs> The Ray Stevens version is a riot. You need to get on YouTube and listen to it's Misty old, by Ray Stevens. Well, like, and it made it, it was a top 40 oh, hit. Well, yeah. His version on, of on, it was Even on too. pop radio, it's, it was like, it's like the late 70s. It's a good version. So, now. anyway, it's Thursday night. And we noticed that uh, it's beginning. To look like no, a Christmas. No, no. <laughs> It's, I think it's we've getting, been there. It's getting lighter. It's, not, it's staying earlier. lighter. Uh, it's no, staying, no, no. It's no. staying lighter. It's staying lighter longer. longer. Right, yes. right. Slowly creeping that? up. So, anyway. That I'm going to go back to a summer of 69 for me. Oh, boy. I was only, um, how old was I? 14. 14. <laughs> I feel like Jill Biden. I'm cueing you on what to say. <laughs> that's about well, as political you know, as we're gonna get I know, tonight. That's okay. That's, well, and let's let's do the song. But then. if I have a suit coat on, I can put the pock the pencil in the pocket. I I'm know. just oh, I'm done. 
There we go. Well, we don't have Bernie in the background tonight. No, Bernie's <laughs> not here. Bernie's at least not yet. He's Boy, they not. wore that out. Didn't <laughs> but he made a lot of money, and he gave it away. So good for him. Good for him. Yeah, well, whatever. Okay, where are we going? What that are we doing? Sunday, ah! that summer, 1969, Nat King Cole. That's right. Oh, That's right. This is my music. This is my music. If ah! I... You can't start yet. I'm oh. not ready. Now you can start. If I had to choose just one day to last my whole life through, it should and would surely be that Sunday. <laughs> this and is we can't live. redo this either. <laughs> the day that I met you. Newborn whippoorwills were calling from the hills. Summer was a coming in, but fast. Lots of daffodils were showing off their skills. Nodding all together, I could almost hear them whisper. Go on, kiss him. Go on. Him. If I had to choose just one moment to live within my heart, it would be that tender moment, recalling how we started. smiled at me that way that Sunday that summer we look a lot different in 69 <laughs> Well, from 69, we wouldn't be doing this, no, would we? That's right. Mm. Mm. Any Nat Cole fans out there like us? <laughs> if I had to choose one moment to live within my heart, it would be that tender moment, recalling how we started, darling, it would be when you smiled at me. Can you smile when you play? No, it doesn't well, often do it. I'm, I'm thinking, it, you, you people make it look just, you think I'm just sitting here just doodling. I'm actually working. That way, that Sunday, Is this better? that summer. I love that. It's nice. So speaking of that Sunday, this coming Sunday. I'm still smiling. We are uh, on, what is the, the Sunday's date is January 31st, 31st. Ah. Sunday. We're going to be at Harvest Chapel in Venice, Florida yes. for their Sunday morning service. Yes. And then the next Monday, which is February 1st. The next morning. We're going to be in St. Petersburg. Yes. At. Sun Coast. Sun Coast Cathedral for their Silver Saints concert breakfast 9 30 in the morning 9 30 in the morning so maybe if you're listening out there and and even if this is a rebroadcast and you'd like to come and you're you listening it. to <laughs> if it's a rebroadcast so no, you missed it no he didn't miss, not if they listen to it tomorrow if they watch the it february day. 2nd well that's true they've missed it yeah, but still they're not missing this and this right is not worth missing <laughs> I love you so much. Anyway, get on SueDuffield.com. I'll, I'll post you're, a few things later, and I'll make I'll put some uh, information more about those two uh, 
do. That first, really, some live dates that we have not done outside opposed, of the apartment as here. As opposed to dead dates, that's, which, that's, is which is much opposed. preferable. That's right. So anyway. So this oh. is what happens when you lock people up in rooms for weeks <laughs> at a time. For Let weeks, that be a lesson to weeks you. weeks and weeks and weeks. My not, my, that's my second non-political statement no, no, tonight. But okay. this is what happens, especially when you do this to musicians. I know, I know. It's so but more I'm singing. smiling. This is about singing. I'm this smiling. isn't a podcast. We I'm, did that on Tuesday. No, but I'm smiling. Okay. <laughs> Can we do this lovely song? We'll We're going to go back a few years with this one, too. We'll see. See if I can and, remember what uh, song, what key we did this in. I know you didn't write it down. I know, but it's just some That's things okay. you don't have to. But we, I, we love the requests that come in, and, and by all means, you know, if we don't get a chance to see it right now because you're too far away, if you we can't see you now in your requests, uh, we'll definitely do it next next week for sure. And I'll be smiling. And we'll be smiling, like the woman at the well. I was seeking Give me room here. for things that could not satisfy. And then I heard my Savior speaking, draw from my well that never shall run dry. Fill cup, Lord, I lift it up, Lord, come and quench this thirsting of my soul, bread of heaven, feed me till Fill my cup, fill it up, and make me whole. There are millions in the world who are craving the pleasures, earthly things of gold, but none can match the wondrous treasure that I find in Jesus Christ my Lord fill my cup Lord I lift it up Lord come and quench this thirsting of my soul Bread of heaven, feed me till I want no more. Fill my cup, fill it up, and make me whole. Fill my cup, Lord, I lift it up. few years too so then we speaking had speaking of going back where you're going that's what i was trying to say so it's some yeah, it seems like someone said that you're in rare form tonight i promise <laughs> don't, don't keep it's me okay you know what he lost house. his keys this morning 
He lied. Uh-uh. No, he blamed me. Uh-uh. Yes, you did. Uh-uh. You couldn't find Inquiring your keys. Inquiring minds wanted to know. You couldn't find your keys. I could not find my keys. And right. they were in his pocket the and whole some, time. Someone. They were in his pocket the whole time. Someone is, is guilty on a regular, his, regularly guilty. They were in his pocket the of whole time. picking up the piano player's keys. <laughs> He has two places he puts okay, them. Okay, hurry up. We gotta no, sing. we're not in any hurry. I'm watching the clock up here. We got a lot of time. <laughs> and oh someone, I'm so sorry. someone is known to pick up the said piano player's well, keys. And I walk didn't out. this time, though. I didn't. You, that, and I in, did. I not say they were in your little pouch pocket on your uh, on your I'm sweatshirt. I'm not used to have. Yeah, I'm not used to having the pockets here. You Whatever. know. I, I okay. had the po- I, I thought it was in my. So cup. anyway, 1969. Did I not apologize? We were yes. Okay. We were we were part of the Jesus People movement. We so. really were, and uh, we had a one way Bible. And we sang in a lot of coffee houses back There's in the only one, one way. way. That's what that's another song. So one we actually uh, did one of Larry Norman's tunes back and recorded it back in the early seventies. Yes, we and did. No, we recorded mid seventies, but I don't want to be correcting. Okay. Anything. Yeah. And so I just um, I can't even begin to tell you how. When we sang this song, the very first phrase when we were practicing beforehand, we actually do rehearse. Occasionally. Maybe about 10 minutes. When we can't find our keys. Right. That's when we rehearse. Or the key to the song. <laughs> um, These we actually are do. But this was such a great You're story song. Messing. Such a great story song. And this reminds me of those coffee house days, Jeff Duffield. Mm. And it's, it's funny called. because neither one of us drink coffee. No, we don't drink coffee. We would drink tea in the coffee houses. But a lot of kids came to the Lord. A lot of kids. And it was so fun to read a story just this last couple of weeks here that one of our wonderful listeners who has now fast become one of our friends, I'm call, I'm claiming her. Um, she actually found Jesus at a Sammy Hall rally and uh, just brought back so many memories of our early early ministry in the 70s. And after we left Sammy Hall, we went back home and started a ministry of our own. And here we are 47 years later. (laughs) Some say he was an outlaw, that he roamed across the land with a band of unschooled ruffians and a few old fishermen. No one knew just where he came from or exactly what he'd done. But they said it must be something bad that kept him on the run. Some say he was a poet, that he'd stand upon a hill. That his voice would calm an angry crowd And make the waves stand still That he spoke in many parables That few could understand But the people sat for hours Just to listen to this man Some say a sorcerer a man of mystery he could walk upon the water he could make a blind man see that he conjured wine at weddings and did tricks with fish and bread that he talked of being born again and raised people from the dead some say a politician who spoke of being free he was followed by the masses on the shores of galilee he spoke out against corruption And he bowed to no decree And they feared his strength and power 
So they nailed him to a tree Some say he was the son of God A man above all men That he came to be a servant And to set us free from sin And that's who I believe he is Cause that's who I believe And I think we should get ready now Cause it's time for us to leave Life was filled with guns and wars And everyone got trampled on the floor I wish we'd all been ready Children died as the days grew cold A piece of bread could buy a bag of gold I wish we'd all There's no time to change your mind The sun has come And you've been left behind A man and wife asleep in bed she hears a noise and turns her head, he's gone. I wish we'd all been ready. Two men walking up a hill, one disappears and one's left standing still. I wish we'd all been ready. There's no time to change your mind The sun has come And you've been left behind You've been left behind No, don't be left behind Was filled with guns and war, and everyone got trampled on the floor. I wish we'd all been ready. Don't you feel like possibly we are living in unprecedented times? Revivals are breaking out all across the world. People are coming to Christ like never before. And we're getting hit with a lot of things that we can't understand. Little did Larry Norman know, probably in those late 60s and early 70s, how congruent and how realistic and scripturally correct he was. One day, Jesus is coming back, and I pray that you'll be ready for him. And one of the ways that I've found that I'm ready for him is by constantly staying in the Word of God. And uh, that's what's gotten me through. It, it really has. It got me through. I turned off the news. I've turned off social media to, unless it's time for us to check you out and for us to check each other out. Or, But I have not been living on what I see. I've not been living on the experiences of, of the what I would call Holocaust living right now. But I have been living on the breathing word of Christ every day and what a difference it's made in my heart and in my life. And I pray that for you tonight. I pray that for you. Jeff and I will be endeavoring a lot of online opportunities coming up in the next several months. And uh, we've already expanded our, our podcast to some new networks. And 
If you haven't tuned in to the podcast, please get on Subiquitous Podcast, released every Tuesday morning on your favorite podcast network. But in the meantime, we're reaching an, a, an interesting audience, some unchurched, some that have not been to church in, in decades for that matter. And my approach has always been to live the gospel first and then sing if you have to, <laughs> right? You know, we mentioned something about YouTube, not to interrupt you, but I am. Um, hit the subscribe button yes, and the bell. Yes, you can do that. That's and then right. you get all kinds of notifications yeah. when we're right. going to be on. That's true. Anyway. And that thank you for reminding me I that. I know, we keep forgetting it. A lot of things that uh, we're trying to make simpler by subscribing on YouTube. If you're ever afraid that Facebook is going to fade away and maybe not allow us to do what we're doing, YouTube has, has already given uh, at least a two to five year promise that they will not be censoring. So we're going to hopefully uh, abide by those rules. And um, we're, we're just thanking God for that. So youtube.com forward slash Sue Duffield. You'll always have the Couch to Kitchen concerts there as well, broadcast live, as well as our podcast. But I've been thinking about uh, seniors a lot because we are those. We are seniors. We have <laughs> we, we qualify for Medicare. And I've been thinking about how we can get our music and get our podcast into the ears of seniors around the world. And any help that you might have on your end, uh, possibly by sharing this podcast and sharing this particular Couch to Kitchen with some shut-ins that may have a, a smartphone, they may have a computer, they may have an iPad. And if they don't, I'm going to be coming up in the next couple of weeks with some ideas on how we can get these concerts and get some of our seniors that have been under lockdown. They need Jesus just as much as, as those of us that are still kicking here. But I love you so much and I thank you in advance for all your, your generous uh, giving and your financial blessings. You have blessed us. Get on SueDuffield.com and there's plenty of ways that you, you can do that. How can we pray for you too, for that matter? I would love to hear that. And as we go back, when we're finished this live broadcast, we go back and we review the comments. We review all the messages. And if we can pray for you, oh, what an honor and what a joy that would be. Because he hideth my soul in the cleft of the rock. That's what he does. A wonderful Savior is Jesus my Lord. A wonderful Wonderful Savior to me. He hideth my soul in the cleft of the rock where rivers of pleasure I see. He hideth my soul. In the cleft of the rock That shadows a dry, thirsty land He hideth my life In the depths of His love And covers me there With His hand me there with his hand. A wonderful Savior is Jesus my Lord. He taketh my burden away. He holdeth me up and I shall not be moved. He giveth me strength as my day. He hideth my soul in the cleft of the rock that shadows a dry, thirsty land. He hideth my life in the 
depths of his love and covers me there with his hand and covers me there with his hand. Oh, I love this last chorus. Here it is. When clothed in his brightness, transported, I rise to meet him in clouds in the sky. His perfect salvation, his one. a dry thirsty land he hideth my life in the depths of his love and covers me there with his hand and covers me Don't forget to share it wherever you are. We count it all blessing and all honor that you're with us tonight. We'll see you next week.